How's it going? Kingsley here. So I'm just going to quickly show you how to resolve this issue after installing JDK. But the first thing I do is make sure that you've installed the correct JDK software for your system. Uh, you can just follow the link here above or you can just Google it. I'm sure you know how to do that. So to resolve this issue, I'm going to be using quite a few shortcuts. And the first thing you need to do is press the Windows key and the letter E. This should open your file explorer in the computer section. Then just go into your C drive. Then go to program files, then Java, then JDK, and then bin. Now if you've installed JDK in a different uh, path, well then you'd need to go to that location and just locate the JDK folder and then go into the bin. And then the next thing you want to do is just copy the path to this folder. So we'll just close this and then the next thing to do is just press the Windows key again and hit the letter R to open your run command. Now within the run command, I want you to type in system properties advance and then just press OK. Now this should open your system properties advance. Then hit environment variables. And then where it says system variables, just go down and look for path. So once you find the path, just click edit. So semicolon, you can control V or you can right click and paste. And then just press OK ok again ok again and then within the run command as before just type in cmd and then type in java c dash version same as before hit enter and it should be working 